Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. And this is my video review of the Boltoon brand. You see the brand name there and the brand name there. This is the model BR001. This is their version 5.0 auxiliary Bluetooth adapter. These are really cool devices because they allow you to use any 3.5 millimeter auxiliary input on any kind of amplifier you have or your car radio and allow you to stream music from a mobile phone like this mobile phone right here, Nexus 6. Also allows you to accept calls because it has a built-in little microphone there. So it comes with a little instruction booklet, a USB charging cable, and a 3.5 millimeter audio cable, and a little 3.5 millimeter plug. So this plug goes right into the side there, but you don't have to use that plug. If you want, you could use the longer cable. If it makes it more convenient to get to your line input. Now, when you charge this, it's very simple. You plug it into the micro USB port using the included cable. And this display right here will be green. And when it's fully charged, this will extinguish and turn off. Very simple. This is your volume up, volume down, or holding it longer is for track changes. So you want to charge this, give it a good charge for about an hour and a half until that extinguishes and then you can go ahead and use it. This also supports aptx-hd for a full 24-bit streaming so it's even better than CD quality. It uh, has a really long lasting battery so in a standby mode where it's not actually streaming or it's not actually connected to Bluetooth, it uses very little energy, it'll last 120 hours. When it's in use, where it's streaming, where it's using more energy, it'll work for up to 15 hours of playback. Uh, that's, that's a long time. So, you know, you charge it every couple of days and you're set to use it then. So the first thing that uh, we're going to do is we're going to do a Bluetooth connection to my mobile phone. So one of the first things you want to do is make sure that your Bluetooth is actually enabled. So on here, we've got the Bluetooth disconnected. Uh, let's click on that and let's enable it. So now it's going to try and find a device. So now I'm going to hold down the play button and it's going to start blinking and the camera is going to be hard to pick up but you can see it is doing a blinking of a blue and a red LED. Now let's see if we can get this device to show up on here and it shows Boltoon right there BR001 and there it says it's connected and uh, there's no media but it is connected. So that was pretty painless allows you to connect right there so you can see it has the name of it right there. So all the functions that this has, I'm going to be uh, describing them in the manual. They do have a nice little table that talks about this. So it says uh, power on and off. You press and hold the power button until the LED indicator flashes and that's that power button right there. Play pause answer or hang up the phone. Press the power button once so you can answer a call by hitting that. You can reject a phone call, so holding this button for more than two seconds. There's a redial function by press the power button twice, so you pulse this twice. And then the volume up and down is right here on the side. Very simple. Previous next track also is on the side right there. So those are the basic functions. Now we're going to test the audio in my car. So in my car I have an auxiliary input right there on the right hard to see with the uh, lighting and I'm going to be using that to test this. So I'm going to use the included cable connected to the connection just to make it a little bit easier for me. So I'm going to turn the device on by holding this button down. The device turned on. Let's take a look at my mobile phone. So I have a song ready to play. I'm going to turn on my radio. 
I turn on my radio and you see it says auxiliary and I hit play and there it is so I'm using my auxiliary input and hearing the the sounds sounds really good too very clear now if I go to the device let's see if I could raise the volume yep let's lower the volume let's see if I can change the track I just changed the track right there I only have one track, so <laughs> very nice, very simple operation, very clear sound. Now, what if I get an incoming call? So let's try, let's try an incoming call to my mobile phone. So I'm going to use another mobile phone to call. I can answer by hitting this button here. Hello? Yep, it worked. You can hear that it's connected. You can hear it on this phone right here. Testing one, two, three. So that worked. So that's nice. It has a built in microphone and allow it allows you to pick up your calls. And once you pick up the call and then you disconnect, the sound comes back to music. So, what's my overall opinion about the Voltoon brand BR001, the auxiliary Bluetooth adapter? As you can see, this thing works really nicely. It uh, paired with my phone and allowed me to stream really high quality sound to my auxiliary input of my car. And again, it'll work with any auxiliary input of an amplifier, preamp, another radio, a boombox another mp3 player another bluetooth player anything that uses the 3.5 millimeter as an auxiliary input so i like this product it's very inexpensive very functional i'm going to give it a full five star rating on my channel please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you're alerted to new video uploads and if you like this review please hit the like button i hope the information i presented helps you with your buying decisions Thanks for watching.